Well, I'm really passionate about tertiary education because it gives people the, the knowledge, the skills, the capability to effectively participate in the modern world. It's not just about jobs or the labour market, it's really about the ability to participate in, actively participate and benefit from society more generally. VU is inspiring to me essentially because of the nature of the institution, the fact that it spans the vet and higher education sectors and has such a diverse range of uh, students from different communities, uh, different cultural backgrounds, refugee backgrounds, um, strong industry engagement, strong community engagement. And you see that if you go to a graduation ceremony, just in terms of the feeling in the room, the feeling of realised aspiration and achievement. For a lot of the people at VU, that was something that was never really seen to be something that they were going to be uh, able to get for most of, their, most of their life. So the achievement through VU is um, something which is really, really significant for them. And the fact that they can do it uh, through VET and through higher ed is its other great strength, of course. From a young age, I was powerfully influenced by the experience of my father who left school when he was only 12 years old, self-educated himself in the public libraries of Western Australia, rose to senior positions in hospital administration in Western Australia, but then when it came to doing the external studies course that was required uh, for people in his position, or certainly to go any further, um, he walked. He didn't have the, um, the understanding of what it meant to do a tertiary course, to do a university course, uh, and he never, um, he never completed it. One of Peter's greatest strengths is his commitment to the field of tertiary education. He's been a recognised expert in this sector for such a long time and has made such a difference um, to policy and research in this area. Uh, what we have achieved, I think, is getting the whole case for a much more coherent tertiary system on the national policy agenda. I think Peter embodies something about the way that Victoria University thinks and works in that he is really committed to high quality but he's also very practical. He makes sure that the research and the advice that he's providing is really going to make a difference for learners from all kinds of backgrounds. I'm delighted that the Vice-Chancellor has chosen to honour Peter with this award and it's an absolute privilege to be working with him at the Mitchell Institute.